gardening. Still only from Steel Dealers. Joni Mitchell is really one of the most influential female artists of the late 20th century. Have a listen. Don't it always seem to go? You don't know what you've got till it's gone. They paid paradise, put up a parking lot. Grammy winning singer Joni Mitchell blazed a trail through the 1970s. Sing it with me. We are stars. Rolling Stone called her one of the greatest songwriters ever. But my heart cried out for you, California. Oh, California, I'm coming home. Her music stirring the purest of emotions. Don't give yourself away. Now some of our favourite Aussie artists are celebrating her music. Oh wow. The show is called Both Sides Now and Wendy Matthews is with us in the studio. Good morning to you, Hello. Wendy. Thank Hello. you so much for joining Hi. us. Pleasure. Oh, just such a, um, a, a beautiful thing to go through the life and the works of Joni oh, Mitchell, same. isn't it? Yeah. What is it about Joni's music that has inspired you? For me, she's an incredible poet. She can put these universal, feel deep universal feelings that we all have into words that we can all relate to, all understand, and that's a huge art. Um, her chord progressions are just out of this world. She just does her own thing. Um, brilliant songwriter. You're Canadian, eh? Mm, uh, what's it all about with you guys, with her and, <laughs> and with Neil Young? I mean, it, it must have a special meaning being a Canadian artist. It and does, actually. Joni, this worldwide Joni really gets me in my bones as far as Canada goes. She's yeah. synonymous with mm. four strong seasons and, and uh, Canada for me. Wow. Mm. And, and was she an inspiration to you as a child growing up in Canada? Huge. My parents were young parents of the 60s and they... They used to really look forward to people's new records. Everybody from Led Zeppelin to Joni. So she was um, she was a very popular in our house. Mm. All right, but if you're going to narrow down as a Joni oh. head, no. your favourite Joni album, and the, the correct answer is Court and Spark, but I'm going to hear what you're going to say. <laughs> oh, here we are. What do you think? Do you have a favourite Joni period or album? I do. Night Ride Home just thrills me because it's her later years. Yep. She's five packs of Marlboro into this <laughs> low, warm, round voice. It's not that sort of ice-cutting, high, high thing, which is glorious as well. So tell us about this show and who you're joining forces with on yes. stage. The other night I was talking to somebody about this and I said, well, it's incredible. There's Kristen Berardi, who's just this most jazz diva goddess. There's Katie Noonan, Ella Hooper, Melinda Schneider. And then I said, and there's a fifth one. I can't remember the fifth one. Is it you? <laughs> Wendy! <laughs> I was brushing my teeth that night going, oh, I'm the fifth! It's, it's me! me. God, anyway, it's me. so there's some wonderful women and we each have our own sort of categories oh of songs God. and um, beautiful band. It's like a 16-piece plus strings. Oh, my God. Wow. Well, that's what you need that. For yeah, you do. stuff as well. Exactly. Um, you know, we were just watching two... Uh, versions of both sides now that have been sort of brought back mm. to popular culture. Obviously the incredible Emma Thompson scene mm. in Love Actually. actually. <gasps> and Coda, which I actually cannot watch that film without sobbing for an hour. I mean, it's interesting how... Yeah, absolutely. She's just... Um... I can hear it in The Day You Went Away. Oh, mm. well, yes. You know what I mean? Yeah, I can yeah, hear I touches do, of Joni there too. I mean, yep, don't you yep. think that she was... She's there somewhere in your DNA. Oh, absolutely. She's be, she's become part of the fabric. As a songwriter, would you, as a, a female songwriter as well, would you sit there and say, well, what would Joni do? Absolutely. Really? And I think that puts you in pretty good stead as wow. well. <laughs> well, this is going to be a fabulous tribute, um, and there is going to be a lot of hunger for these tickets. So oh, <laughs> we're okay. going to make sure that people know where to go. Both sides now, live.com is where you can book your tickets for the show. Um, don't miss it. What a great lineup of Aussie. Mm. I love that to see you. Artists. And you. Thank you, Wendy. Thank you so much wow. for coming in.